Nextcloud users stay in contact with each other through talk. You can use it for chat, one-on-one -on -one and group calls, but also for webinars and presentations. In our previous release, we introduced recording of calls. Once the recording is done, you will get notified. The recording is a file shared with you, and if you want, you can share the recording to other participants. The second major feature we introduced was breakout rooms. You can let talk split the room for you, do it manually, or let people choose by themselves. In the breakout sessions, you can discuss and brainstorm while the moderators can move between rooms. At the end of the discussion, a moderator simply removes the rooms and everyone is back in the main room. So let's discuss the results of our breakout discussion. I would like to record this session. Now, when I stop the recording, or simply at the end of the call, I get the recording shared with me. Talk notifies me that the recording is shared with me. I can, with one click, share it in the room if I want, but there's more. We demoed our smart picker earlier to easily add a link to a location or a task from Deck. We brought the smart picker also to Talk, and it can do everything it can do in text and collectives. But you might be wondering, where are my GIFs? Some of you prefer them pronounced as GIFs, but we have them either way. As you can see, Talk gained some key features. For our Hub 5 release, we looked again at these features and how to improve them further. First, when you record a call, you will get a transcript. This is created by an AI, but not by sending your data to a third-party service. It all happens on your server so no data leaks. A second AI improvement we introduce is translating messages. And again, it happens on your server. With other translation or transcription technologies, you have to send the text and video to a web service, losing control over your data, not with Nextcloud Talk. We are the first to bring chat translation and transcribing of calls all on your server. But there is much more new in Talk. Now let's look at the chat and calls more closely. You can now set a custom avatar for a group chat, maybe just an emoji or an image of your choice. By the way, notice that you can now see people typing and can mention groups. Isn't that nice? Ah, it seems we have a call. Let's join. We can now also pick a nice background. So let's be on the beach for this call. During editing of documents, you now have the media controls available. That wraps it up. Hub 5 is another big step forward. Nextcloud Talk has all the basics of a powerful chat and video conferencing tool, from breakout rooms to cutting edge features like AI-based translation. But all this happens on your server. We look forward to hearing your thoughts on Hub 5 and Talk.